Today I've got the North American RLCS Major Champion, Chicago, with me, and we got a bunch of solid 2v2 games with him. I feel like when I play with Chicago, it's super easy to read the game because he covers the ground so well. I actually ended up recording way too many games for one video, so if you guys want to see a part 2, let me know. It also seems like you guys like the unedited games, so I thought I'd let these games run through. But I hope you guys enjoyed these sweaty matches, we ended up running into a few other pros. As always, I'll do my best to get as much info out there for you guys in each game, but let's jump in and see how we do. Oh, we got the Power Boys. We got Nibra and Forky. Their last player is Noxus, but obviously this is 2v2. See how this goes. There we go. At least get them off, the, get them off that ball. Good clear from Chicago. That opens up some space for me to get some boosts. Let them go first. Up to the corner. Maybe I can get some boosts here. Good demos open. There we go. Nice, nice little uh, delay on the air dribble. Those are always really good if you want to force the ball back into yourself. Is to position yourself where the pl player is going to clear the ball again, and then just go uh, fake. Uh, go uh, away from the ball a little bit, so that way they actually hit it back into you and it bounces off off their car or bounces off your car. I'm gonna wait for this touch. Go for the bump, bump on me, but there should be some space. Oh, it's in. I'm not sure what happened. I tried to bait in the, the high touch, and I think he got a soft touch. Or he actually caught on the wall and finished it. Oh, wow. What a shot. Tried to go over his demo. Didn't quite get there. All right. That's unfortunate because he's going to have no boost. What well, underneath me? That's a little scary. I right, should be an open shot for him. Close. I tried to like bait that in a little bit and stop the ball, but didn't quite get the touch I wanted. It's not the, not the greatest either. Should be okay though. Oh, oh, he's not going. Okay, we're okay. We're okay. We got some space. I thought he was gonna go shoot that immediately, but he he waited for some reason. Make sure to uh, bait bait him in there a little bit. Don't touch it. Get a nice solid clear. Be an awkward turn for a forky on the wall here. Just trying to go for a demo. Back off after that. Nice 50-50. Gonna be alone for a little bit here. I did miss the boost in the corner, but uh, I didn't need it for that challenge, so I just moved forward. Once I miss the boost, I can't go for it again, so. If Nibra just turns, oh, that's okay. I guess you got a block. Keep it to the side a little bit, good bump. Good fake. Tried to read the fake. That's the classic G2 move right there. Oh, come here. I bumped him. Excuse me? Good flick. Can't quite follow this. Ooh. Flick it over him. Good follow up. Maybe he can get a 50-50 here. Top left corner, close. Stay with this on the wall. Close, got some space now. Hopefully Chicago can stay with this. Nice. Nice follow up. Put that around him first. Oh, he got the boost. Stay with this now. Close. Try to wave dash on the wall to get to it. He went. That's okay though. No one there. I think Chicago's gonna be able to get this boost, hopefully. 
The pinch. Make sure I bump Nibra on the way back. Try to stay with this if I can. Nice little block. Hopefully this boost will spawn. I think that Forky took it, so I'm gonna be pretty low here. Nice block. Hopefully that's enough. He missed. Nice, I'm a little disoriented actually. Pop it to the left side, I need some boost. I was gonna get the mid boost, I'll get the back corner. 50-50. Pop it up nice and high. Force him out a little bit. I'm forky out as well. It's their last player. So close. Pretty dangerous for Chicago. If I landed, I could have maybe made it to that and, and redirected it, but unfortunately, no. See what they do. He jumps up pretty early. Could be both of them, actually. Good fake. Nice flick. That up to Chicago, but unfortunately, I used a lot of my boost to do that turn, so I have to go back for boost here. Nice shot. Pretty awkward bounce. Up to Chicago. I mean, uh, Forky, if I can. I might have given that right to Nibra. He missed, though. Okay, we're good. Panicking a little bit. Take their boost. Pumping Forky. Nice channel by Chicago. I'm surprised they missed that. And what a finish. <laughs> oh my goodness. We got out of that alive. I'm surprised because we... Uh, I didn't realize the mid pass there was going to be really bad. I, it's definitely more of like a threes thing to pop that out like that. I should have expected that Chicago was underneath me, but... Well played from him to get that flip reset. I definitely got carried a little bit that game. I didn't I didn't play that great. So we got 15 points actually. Holy crap. I got them again. We got the Power Boys. Hopefully we can uh, do a little better uh, this game on my end. 50-50. We're going to back off here. A nice little flick. At least force out the challenge. Decent shot. Oh my god. Is that off the bar? Surely I don't miss this. <laughs> Oh my goodness, what just happened? Did, did Forky just boom it off his own crossbar? Oh, he did. And a decent 50 50 from Chicago to pop it up. Pretty, pretty free for me to get that one. Make it pretty awkward for Forky. He's pretty low boost. Uh oh. Got the demo though. Nice 50 50. There's no boost here, so unfortunately, we're going to be a little bit trapped. Nice. That worked out. At least got the block should stall out for Chicago's spawn. Get a nice solid clear. And I got some time. Got some time for some boost pads. Good cutoff from Chicago too. Nice block. He's very low boost. I can see that from the way he's moving. So I need to play this accordingly. And by that I mean I can't go for an immediate challenge. That worked out. <laughs> it shouldn't have, but it worked out. I kind of didn't clear it high enough. Chicago's still very, very low. I should give him enough time. And actually, honestly, I'm going to get the demo on Forky here and try to move behind for some boost pads. I actually thought I heard Forky behind me. 
which is why I boomed that forward towards the goal. It was a throwaway of possession if he's not there, but for some reason I heard him to my left behind me. Oh, he can't make it. Should be okay. It's clear. I'm going to fake him here and then go off the side. It's going to be good for us. Good try. Help him off a little bit. Uh, Chicago should have this first. Good fake on the demo. Just waiting for them to throw the ball away. Oh, that's a good save. Try to like posture a little bit to fake it and then shoot it further. Good fake. Should be enough. There we go. That was a really good play from Chicago to go for the, the jump. But even if he can't get to it, he's actually forcing the player a little bit higher up and then I can get the save. That's what it's all about in Rocket League nowadays is like using the two players in one positional play. If you go too early without your, without backing up your teammate, you're going to be in trouble. What an angle. Oh my gosh. There we go. Wasn't the greatest of passes, but I tried to just pop it forward. I was maybe trying to set up a double off the sidewall, but it was pretty difficult and not really worth the mechanics to to do it. Let's see what Forky does. He's backing off. That's ah, bad. Bad flick. So instead of going all the way back, I'm going to try and get the bump in middle. Nice follow up. There we go. I see the bottom left. I just shoot it really quickly there. Um, I see that Forky lock let go of the possession and there I can actually like, uh, you know, just chip it around him. And then because, uh, Nibber was last man, he just went for that immediate challenge and I can find that bottom left spot pretty open as long as I do it really quickly and just do a quick corner. You want to make sure you get that corner of the car when you go for the shot. It goes really, really fast and bangs the ball. But we got the next game. We got Ajax and Cheese. It'll be a solid game here. They're actually partied up. Really high level lobbies tonight. We go. Oh, that should be good enough. I mean it here. We get the block. Ajax is kind of awkward. I'm gonna fake him here. I would rather fake him there and not overcommit and at least like cause pressure rather than try to force the open shot. And you can see that we actually got a goal because of it too. If I went for the immediate shot there and went with power, there's a good chance that they could save it. It could go really hard off the backboard and clear back into midfield when we are in a position where we can't really, uh, you know, cover for it. Because we're, we're also trying to fight for boost on their side. That's okay. There's over one. Nice little shot. And there we go. Nice little flick. So right there, I'm just using the space. That, that quick little chip's going to pop it over Ajax when he's doing that quick turn. The reason why Ajax is going is because I'm last man there, so I know that. I'm trying to make sure I keep the play safe, but also uh, still dangerous for them. I'll pop that off the wall and just leave. No boost. Also mess up my flip. Off the wall really quick. I'm going to fake this because he's going to go. Try to block him. Not the, not the greatest of plays. Nice block. I'm going to fake him. Nice. Good play. Let's cause some pressure. Nice. She's probably going to have this. That's bad. I didn't mean to throw the ball away like that. I bumped Cheese off though, or Ajax. Do have some space. Not the greatest though. Wants to fake this? Maybe he's gonna go for it. Just gonna wait for it. Got the boost. Up a little bit. Pop it up. Hope I can grab this boost and turn immediately. Pop it up a little bit. Once again, just being a nuisance. What a block. Is that gonna be in? Oh my goodness. No way. <laughs> 
Should be a shot. Nice. There we go. Found the opening. Uh, that was really good pressure. We, I, I, I tried to fake that one guy, and he ended up like pinching it with me into the the bottom of their their, top, their crossbar. <laughs> I guess there was a fight for the boost in the corner somewhere. All right, let's see if I can astral pinch this. Oh, pfft. nope. I fake this. Nice. Grab the wall if I can. Oh, he went low. Good luck. That's a good shot. That's really tough. I probably should have went. Um, I probably should have went a little bit higher on the ball or lower on the ball. At least follow it. But it's so hard because anyone can do anything at this point. Pretty tough shot here. Good save. Did I get it? No, I went too high. No, I almost got the reads too. It's all good. I tried to get back and just try to pre-jump it. Get somewhere on the ball, but that immediate challenge from Chicago is going to be really dangerous for us. Second man challenges in, in, in twos are the hardest thing to balance in the game, I would say. Right, let's just stay with this. Both of them. Nice. It's going to work out. It's going to have it. I'm going to back off. I got bumped into their net. I'm not sure if Ajax meant to do that. I think he did. Oh my gosh. Nice little flick. Cheese is pretty low. I'm going to grab their corner boost as well. Got their boost. It's a bit of loop on this boost as well. Oh, he bumped me as well. Ah, oh, it's a lot of his wells. <laughs> I'm gonna move behind here. Out. I probably shouldn't have went for that. Might be a goal too. I nice save. Can I get there. Nice. Keep it close. I didn't realize I was last there. It was kind of dangerous. Well, good luck. Got over the one. Let him just go. I, I, I didn't really have a good position on that. I wanted to get the boost steal. Nice bump. So bad. So bad. So bad. So bad. Nice. Good double. Nope. Should be Chicago's ball now. Just forcing him up once again. It's that, it's that second man, first man challenge. Just to be down. There we go. Oh, play. That was a good game. It was pretty solid. Really, uh, really stressful, but we got it and we got 12 points for that one.